Apple releases iOS 18 and iPadOS 18 Beta 7 to developers with better stability and new features. Apple has released Beta 7 of its forthcoming iOS 18 and iPadOS 18 update to developers, which they can test to curate bugs and issues ahead of the official release next month. The update is well ahead in the beta cycle, and with every passing build, iOS 18 is becoming more stable and rich in features which the company announced at its WWDC event in June. Apple has released iOS 18 and iPadOS 18 to developers, which they can download and install to curate bugs for a stable release next month registered developers who are testing iOS 18 and iPadOS 18 on their compatible iPhone models can download Beta 7 through the settings app. Before you install the update, you have to make sure that your Apple ID is linked to your developer account, and if it is not, your device will not receive the update over the air. To download and install the latest iOS 18 build, all you have to do is head over to Settings and GT, General and GT, Software Update and GT, Beta Updates and GT, and then follow the on-screen instructions. The latest update will fix most issues and bugs that were not addressed in the prior beta builds, which means the update will be more stable than prior betas. If you are not following the latest news related to iOS 18, the update will bring a handful of visual changes and eye features to the iPhone. While on device features will be available to all users on older iPhone models as well, the new Apple Intelligence features and the new Siri experience will be available only on the latest iPhone models, starting from the 15 Pro and the forthcoming iPhone 16 lineup. Visually. Apple has finally allowed users to place SAP icons anywhere on the home screen and change the look of the apps as well with a wide variety of customization tools. Moreover, the new control center has been redesigned as well with support for multiple pages, which you can organize according to your preferences. There are a boatload of additional features, so do check them out if you are planning to install the latest iOS 18 Beta 7. Note that the process to install the build on your iPad is the same. Apple will release iOS 18 and additional updates next month, possibly in the first half of September. The company has also released Mako's Sequoia Beta 7 to developers, so do check that out as well. We will be covering the guides related to the builds in extensive detail as soon as the update is available to the general public.